affirm AHF trial, which adds to the evidence of benefit with IV iron in patients with heart failure with reduced EF. Affirm AHF evaluated the efficacy of IV carboxymaltose in iron deficient patients admitted hospitalized for acute heart failure with a primary endpoint of total heart failure hospitalizations and cardiovascular death. Inclusion criteria included hospitalized heart failure patients with LVEF less than 50%, iron deficiency, again, defined in the standard way of either ferritin less than 100 or 100 to 300 accompanied with PSAT less than 20%, and hemoglobin range of 8 to 15. Patients were randomized to ferric carboxymaltose or placebo after stabilization of acute heart failure with standard therapies and could receive their first dose of the study drug at or before discharge. After enrollment and in follow-up, which extended to 24 weeks with five visits, patients received IV ferric carboxymaltose according to their hemoglobin levels as well as body weight. And 1,000 milligrams if the hemoglobin level was less than or equal to 14, or 500 milligrams if between 14 and 15 at the first visit, and the subsequent dosing in a sliding scale fashion. In this trial, ferric carboxymaltose resulted in a nominal reduction in the primary endpoint of total heart failure hospitalizations and cardiovascular death and missed the significance by a small margin at the 0.059 level. Component of the primary endpoint, total heart failure hospitalizations were significantly reduced by approximately 26%, which was significant, but there was no effect as expected on cardiovascular mortality. Remainder of the secondary endpoints are shown on this slide, most showing favorable trends and those um, that included heart failure hospitalizations or heart failure hospitalization or cardiovascular death reaching significance. The investigators completed a very interesting uh, pre-specified analysis, excluding patients recruited during the COVID surge time. When those patients were excluded, all endpoints including the primary endpoint of total heart failure hospitalizations and cardiovascular death reach significance. The investigators identified this analysis as a pre-specified strategy and reported both their intention to treat as well as COVID-censored results. Treatment was safe with equal distribution of serious adverse events or other adverse event rates. Um, there was transient hypophosphatemia, which is common, which can be seen um, with uh, these agents uh, throughout the study. But uh, at the end of the study, actually, there was no significant difference between placebo as um, compared to the ferric carboxymaltose group. Mm -hmm.